On November 6, the first ever virtual financial fair will take place. The man behind us is Olivier Colombin. He's head of independent asset managers for Lombard Hobier, and he's also the founder of Emerging. Olivier, welcome to the studio. Thank you, Nicolette. Thank you for the invitation. Now, Olivier, what is virtual FinFair? Okay, uh, virtual FinFair is a fair dedicated or devoted to independent finance experts that would take place on the 6th of November, as you mentioned, and from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m., and that will be accessible online only and in 3D, in a three-dimensional environment. Why online and why in 3D? Because the people we would like to invite on this uh, fair are players that are located in 50 different countries. So you can imagine that um, in terms of investment, in terms of time, money, logistic, and carbon footprint, uh, we cannot afford such an investment. So facing this uh, challenge, we've decided to look for uh, software that could help us to um, recreate in 3D an affair in which we would have uh, booths, visitors, exhibitors, uh, but we didn't know any uh, software like that. And by chance, uh, we've, uh, we found a startup, a Californian start startup, that was working on that kind of, uh, of software. So the result is that uh, since August, uh, the virtual FinFair is now open for registration and either for uh, exhibitors who would like to have a booth or for uh, visitors who would like to attend the, the, the fair in, uh, on November 6, uh, they now are in a position to sign in uh, on the virtual FinFair site. So two questions. This is reserved for your members, for the emerging members. Yes. Uh, the objective is to invite all the members and their employees, I mean all the companies that are uh, members on the site, and their employees, approximately 10,000 uh, people, and uh, the exhibitors would be able to uh, invite their own guests. Okay, well let's step back a little. This is being done within the context of emerging. Can you uh, kind of roll back on the history of emerging? With pleasure. Um, so if we uh, go back to 2009, when we launched the first version of emerging, this was actually and basically a B2B dating site dedicated to independent portfolio managers who wanted to meet other independent portfolio managers in order either to, to merge or to sell their business or to create an alliance. Um, four years later and uh, thousand members later, uh, this, the emerging site has become a kind of uh, professional ecosystem. An ecosystem that gathers not only independent portfolio managers, but also lawyers, IT solution providers, um, asset managers, HR consultants, uh, wealth planners. So this has become a professional community uh, that uh, can, at the same time, um, shop on the on the site. Uh, train the, the staff of the, uh, of, of the members, um, use it as a marketing place, or still using it at the, uh, as a B2B dating place. Well, this initiative, I mean, the whole thing, Emerging and the Virtual FinFair, has, a, has created quite a buzz. I'm not going to give any names, but some of the l biggest asset managers on the planet have made inquiries to know whether they could participate. Is that true? Yes, this is true. Um, very, um, I mean, you, you can 
imagine that for those who are uh, in a, who have uh, the mission to promote products uh, when they see a place where you can access to uh, thousand companies managing uh, 300 billion Swiss francs uh, in a click, uh, talking with the bosses of those organizations, uh, it can, it, it's quite uh, attractive. So as long as we were talking about the emerging side, which, were, which is a kind of close community because we do, um, we do accept each new member and each new um, partner, uh, once we, we, we talked about this uh, virtual FinFair, which is open also to, for instance, fund distributors, uh, that became very interesting for them. And, okay, well, you have done quite a few initiatives. So what are the next steps? What do you have in store? Nicolette, you must, you must understand that uh, the people who are, we are talking to on the platform is a very fragmented community. And until recently, a very fragmented community uh, used to be considered as weak because it is an addition of very small players. But uh, uh, since the, uh, the emergence of um, social networks, the rules are changing. And uh, since uh, recently, we can consider that a very well connected community of small fragmented players can become very powerful. So imagine that the only the, the thousand members of the platform uh, already manage 300 billion Swiss francs. So our objective is to get to 1 trillion Swiss francs as soon as possible by feeding the e-store that is on the, on the platform and giving to this professional community new type of financial services uh, that will be developed by, mem by partners to the attention of members. That's the, our objective uh, for the two coming years. Olivier, thank you very much for coming to the studio today. The pleasure was mine, Nicolette. Thank you.